and welcome to another Daddy James Films that Webs.com video tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to talk to you about Pure Guardian. Uh, it's a must-have if you are downloading music or movies. Uh, it will keep those nasty peer-to-peer -peer organizations from seeing what you're downloading. Okay, in this tutorial right here, I'm going to show you about a program called Pure Guardian 2. What is Pure Guardian 2? Pure Guardian 2 is a program which blocks any of these peer-to-peer uh, -peer agencies from looking into your uh, computer and seeing what you have downloaded. This is a program that you should have if you're downloading music, movies, and stuff like that illegally. This will keep all those peer-to-peer uh, -peer agencies from looking to see what you uh, have downloaded. Now to get this program, uh, I have a, a link over here in the description area. Unless, of course, you know, I've just uploaded this video and I haven't got a chance to put the link in there. But I'm pretty much going to have the link over here. So you click on that link and it's going to take you to Mega Upload. And I went ahead and uploaded the file to Mega Upload. And all you have to do is enter in the letters right here and enter them right here and download the file. Now, if you don't want to do it from here, you can just go to uh, you can go to Google and and um, type in Google Peer Guardian 2. Once you do that, you're going to click on the first link. Now, if you have a Mac operating system, uh, you will need to um, type in Peer Guardian OS X, or you can click right here if you have a Mac. Now, when you're ready, just go ahead and click on here. Okay, here you can read a little bit about it. Okay, from here, after you have read about it or you know anything like that, uh, they have a uh, frequently asked question uh, part on here. And um, you go down here where it says download. You're going to click on the first one, regardless of whether you have XP or Vista or whatever. You click on that one, uh, and it'll bring you to this page right here. And this build right here is tested for the following Windows versions. So I believe this one works for all versions. Uh, if you want, you can go ahead and go back and you know pick one of them that had it for your site. Uh, but I believe this is one installer fits all, which says right here. So we're going to click right here. And it's going to ask us to save the file. I went ahead and saved the file. I went ahead and saved it to my desktop. So I already have it there. So I'm going to hit cancel. And this is, should be your install right here. So far, a lot of people has uh, given us a good review. And uh, a lot of people saying it works great. So we're going to go ahead and click on it and install it okay now we're going to come to this uh, window here we're going to hit next accept next 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 um, I wanted to start with Windows so I'm going to go ahead and click right here I'll go ahead and make a desktop icon and put them on quick launch and install doesn't take very long to install. Then it kind of gives you, brings you to this welcome screen. So right here, uh, this wizard will help you customize it. You know exactly how you want them. I'm kind, of, I'm new to this as well, so um, uh, I won't be able to ask you a bunch of questions about it uh, because this is new to me. I just found this out uh, a few days ago. This right here is what ranges uh, do you want to block. Uh, I want the peer-to-peer, uh, peer uh, anti-peer-to-peer uh, organizations. I don't want none of those. Uh, spyware, I don't want no spyware. Uh, government, don't want a government educational. Uh, I'm not sure about that, but I'm going to go ahead and check it. Okay, I'm not sure about that last one. So I'm going to leave that one uh, unchecked. Again, like I'm saying, I'm kind of new to this program too. 
Next. Um, now this part right here is uh, add any custom uh, custom list to you want period guardian to use. Uh, there is a uh, I block list uh, that you can go to where you can uh, block other uh, IP addresses. Okay, and I will also have that link over here in the description too. Uh, if you want, you can block a couple more stuff right here. Um, from what I was uh, in this warning up here, using too many and or appropriate lists may seriously degrade your internet service. So apparently you might not want to use too many of them on here. You might want to use a few of them maybe. But if you choose not to use it, I believe it will still work okay. Like, I'm say, like I said before, I'm kind of new to this one. But uh, it, it doesn't have any, uh, it's not a virus or anything like that. And it works pretty well. Uh, of course, I don't know how to really test this or anything. But uh, let's go ahead and hit next. How often do you want to check for updates? I'll go ahead and leave that on every other day. Uh, I want Peer Guardian and List to come up. Okay, now it's complete. So we'll finish it up and get the interface to come up. Okay, now right now it's updating my list. It's updated Peer Guardian update. Adds Education or Government Peer to Peer and Spyware. Okay, once it's finished updating, just hit close. Um, actually, I kind of missed the splash screen, but uh, there was a little splash screen that came up, and then this popped up. And then you're in the uh, you're in the main interface right here. Uh, you can uh, go right here to settings and change the settings if you like. But uh, I'm gonna, you can also I think you can change the color and backgrounds of it but uh, I'm gonna leave everything the same and just leave well anyhow this is something that you need if you are downloading movies on music whether you're using LimeWire, MooTorrent, uh, BearShare, Morpheus whatever you're using to download uh, you should have uh, this program Pure Guardian 2 it's a must-have program anyways that's it for this tutorial thank you and have a nice day